Alright, hello guys, Jacob from JV Games here, and today I have a gameplay of Black Ops 2. I'm playing at Domination at Standoff. Um, this is me and my friend Alex. We just, sorry it's split screen, we just Domination. decided to record a gameplay, hopefully, and hopefully we did good. We both are rocking the Remington 870 MCS with Captain Fast Mags Jacob. and Lawn Barrel. Um, his kill streaks are UAV. Care package and stealth chopper. Mine is e hunter killer, care package, and lightning strike. So Alex goes out into their spawn, picks up two quick kills, and jumps up onto the the roof of the building here. Um, while I watch his back. Um, that's our strategy mostly for this map. He'll run up, get to the spawn, and uh, try to clear out that sniper room. And I'll watch his back. And if anyone's on the ground while he's up in the room, I got him. Alex just goes to clear out the room and gets picked off. That's my cue to go. I hear a guy behind me shoot at him, fail hitting him, and then I pick up a double kill, almost get killed by a crossbow. I just get killed trying to go back into the by A. Alex picks up that guy really quick there. There we go. I had I had my secondary out, so I had to kill him with my B23R. Get a little cheeky little jump kill right there. And I completely fail at aiming. Alex dies, and we're both just respawning. Alex is going to secure A while he's at it. I almost missed this guy. I would have been really mad if I ran past and he killed me. He was just sit sitting there. Go up, get this guy from behind. Oh, no, I don't, actually. See, I was thought Long Barrel would help me there, but it was just a little too far. Alex sees me going in front, so he cuts into the room to the, about the middle of the map. I'm working back to get into this building. I, there's usually snipers up here if you've ever played that map. I see a guy coming in, pick him off, get a nice little headshot. Alex is chasing this guy, gets a couple hit markers, then gets him. Alex is going to call in his UAV. I pick up the guy that's standing up in the window. I get hit from behind right here, and I apparently Alex picked him off. But I just thought that he was uh, still there, so I'm just kind of sitting there. I head back down by C. I don't think I was in time to get the points. I'm going to head into this room. See a guy. I'm going to chase him down. Get the kill. Alex is really good at staying in the middle of the map and not dying. He, I have to stay towards the edges, mostly. But he can go into the middle pretty quick. He's going to call in his care package right here. I forget what he gets, but I am really lucky that I killed that guy right there because I did not even notice him. I'm going to kill this guy right here. Hunter killer drone on the bloodthirsty metal. I was happy about that. Alex gets the Hellstorm missile. Double taps to get that. He gets blown up right away. Then he's going to call it in. He gets a nice kill here, I think. If I re remember correctly. Yeah, just a double kill. I just picked up a kill there. That was pretty nice. I think I'm running on 8 kills right now. Or seven, and then I think this is the eight, or maybe that was. This is the nine. But I call deployed. the hunter killer drone in, see it land on someone. Going up to the room again, gonna clear him out. And there's a guy. He just kind of just followed him. He didn't really notice me, so I had an easy kill there. Alex is gonna play the objective, get A, picks up that guy. I'm right behind him, so I turn around. Gonna check out the, this area of the map. Alex dies. I head around to the back of the map again. I like playing, sticking to this edge of the map. I don't know why, it's just where I'm most comfortable around this map. So, here, I'm gonna go back, and I am going to get saved by Alex. Bam, I, I can't believe I let that happen. I'm really happy Alex was there. I avenge him because he died. He saved me. That guy had his sights aimed right onto me. I, as you can see, I wasn't really ready. I knifed him, tried attempting to knife him from like 10 feet away. And it was just, it would have been bad. I would have been raging hard if I would have died there because luckily he was able to save me. Almost missed that guy. You know, Alex gets a nice little no scope or hip fire kill. Shouldn't have said no scope. This guy must have like super. 
the round's about to end. And this is where we're going to pick up the Merciless Metal. Pick up that guy. There it is. Merciless Killer. Not even that good. I mean, 10 kills in a row. For me, that's pretty good. I'm not that good at Call of Duty. Um, that was my fourth Merciless Metal. I'm really not that good. Alex is a lot better than I am. I don't know if he does better than me in this game, but he's four, almost, I think he just prestiged a fifth time. I'm, at the time of making this, I'm level 30, but, uh, or 38 or something. Oh no, that's what he was. Okay. I'm almost prestige now. I was 43 making this. I went 17-3 the first round. Alex went 18-8, as you can see. And here, there's the standings again. And we're getting ready to start the second round. And I have all my, uh, per not perks, all my score streaks. He's going to call in his care package. I think he double taps it again to neglect it. I forgot to pick up the flag there. Try shooting my care package out of my gun. Kind of forgot that you had to select it and throw it. Uh, yeah, no, he got uh, countering with me. He double tapped them. Throw my hunter killer up. Get a kill. And <laughs> dolphin dive over my care package because I am a noob and I forgot. Now, this guy, that was my first death in a long time. I, was, I thought I could uh, get him really quick there. But uh, I was just like, oh, I'll turn around and get him. But I didn't. This is my first Hellstorm missile kill. So that's the first time I ever used it. So I know it was pro it was incorrectly used. I didn't use it the, the best way I could have. But <laughs> as I was using, I was like, "Wait, Alex, how do you use these?" I I had no idea what I was doing. Um, so the only thing I know about them is that they were pretty close to what a predator missile was. Alex dies there. He's gonna respawn in the back of the map. I I was amazed when I got that kill. I thought it was just um, shot right through a wall. I run to the spawn, get one of them. I got the second one for a double kill. I'm up in the sniper room while Alex is trying to hop up on top of the building. I die. Alex is gonna just camp out here, wait for his friends, he calls them. He, if someone's sitting behind that little box there that he's aiming at, he calls them his friends. Because they always give him an easy kill. Securing B. I see the guy up in the window. My long barrel couldn't help out enough, so I take out my B23R. I don't even know what happened to him after that. I go up to kill him, and I think Alex got him. Yeah, I think that's what happened. Alex was freaking out there. He didn't even see that guy. He just kind of was going down and he just fires. He was like, oh my god, I didn't even see it. He was like getting really freaked out. Alex picks up a bloodthirsty metal, and then dies, gets one more kill, and then he dies. My run's not completely over, but the better half, I had a better first half, I think Alex had a better second half. Alex just leveled up again, so we both leveled up in this, um, in this gameplay. Alex's gonna pick up his Hellstorm missile, I think he gets a really good kill with this one. I think this one, this is his double kill, I think he got a triple kill with the next one he gets. Um, so, I'm just kind of laying low. I don't think I do too well set the rest of the second half. This is more of Alex's half, so I'll focus more on him. He just got a UAV and a care package. He died. He was running into a spawn. It wasn't going to end well anyway. Gets the trick, picks up the triple kill badge. I'm going to go finish off what he left. He's going to kill. See a guy running. Even though he's a sniper, I kind of run away. Alex gets the double kill. He's gonna get the Hellstorm missile. This is his triple kill, I think. He gets a triple kill. Yeah, no, that was a quad kill. So, he gets a couple raining death medals. Alex is 36 and 12. I don't know what I am right now. I didn't really see my name, just looking at there. Picks up another objective, gets two more kill streaks, calls in his UAV. And there's the round ending. Your final. Alex goes 36 and 12, and wait, this is the weirdest final kill I've ever seen, I don't exactly know what happened here, but I'm pretty sure that guy that was going prone was alive, so, I don't know, that is gonna hurt the bottom Alex goes 36 and 12, I think I went 24, and there, 22 and 8, Alex went 36 and 12, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you guys soon.